The mother of actress Eva Green says the James Bond actress was targeted by Harvey Weinstein. On Friday, Green's mother, French actress Marlene Jobert, told Europe One Radio that her daughter was also sexually harassed by the movie mogul for two years. My daughter Eva was the victim of this horrible man, the 76-year-old star said, adding she was speaking on her daughter's behalf. At the time, I was truly horrified, so scandalized, that I wanted to do something but my daughter said absolutely not, you do not know the evil he is capable of. While her daughter has resisted speaking out personally since allegations concerning Weinstein have arisen, Jobert said she was motivated to add another testimony because it isnt possible that this guy goes unpunished. This odious character must be prosecuted. Green, star of Penny Dreadful, was targeted by Weinstein during 201,011, Jobert said. To escape confrontation, Green tried not to reply. She was intimidated, this guy had so much power, power over all cinema he must have put obstacles in her way because he was so vexed it was difficult, took time to recover, she prefers to forget and not talk about it today. Until her retirement in the 90s, Jobert was a much sought-after star who had played opposite Belmondo, Depardieu and Charles Bronson. Speaking to the news radio station, she described Weinstein as tenacious, he insisted for several months, every time he was in Paris, he called Jobert stressed that Weinstein's approach was a professional rendezvous with the offer of a starring role, under the pretext of a professional appointment, had given her a script with a beautiful key role it. And as his office was also in his hotel suite, they'd go up and then. He promised her, like the others that had favorized their careers in exchange for sexual favors, Eva managed to escape him but he threatened to destroy her professionally, her mother explained. Because if the big pig had been outed by a victim, for revenge he would forbid directors to select them. That's a brutal reaction to take on a young actress because it was putting themselves in danger of being scratched off casting lists, Sports Illustrated swimsuit model Angie Everhart told her own story on Kloss Radio Friday, saying Weinstein once masturbated in front of her while they were both on a boat at the Venice Film Festival years ago, I had just arrived and I was sleeping, I was in my bed, she said. I wake up and Harvey is standing above my bed. That alone is frightening, she continues, all of a sudden he takes his pants down and starts doing his stuff. He's blocking the door. I can't get out and he, I don't know how to say this on the radio, but he finishes on the carpet of the floor. Everhart said Weinstein warned her against telling anyone what had occurred, but when she did she was ignored. Nobody wanted to do anything about it because everyone was terrified of Harvey, she said. Last week, eight women, including actress Ashley Judd, spoke out against Weinstein in a New York Times report, accusing him of sexual harassment and inappropriate behavior. The paper also reported that Weinstein reached private settlements with eight women, including actress Rose McGowan. McGowan has since said she was raped the movie mogul. Weinstein has since been fired from his former studio, The Weinstein Company, and wife Georgina Chapman announced she's leaving him. Following the NYT report about the allegations, Weinstein said in a statement that he was working with therapists and planned to deal with this. Issue head on, on Tuesday, the The New Yorker revealed, among 13 different women's accounts of alleged sexual harassment, assault or rape, that the mogul allegedly forcibly performed oral sex on Italian actress Asia Argento two decades ago. Actresses Mira Sorvino and Rosanna Arquette also claimed that after rejecting Weinstein's unwanted advances, they were removed from or kept from being hired for projects. On Tuesday, Gwyneth Paltrow, Angelina Jolie and several other women added their own accounts of alleged mistreatment, and more than two dozen women have now come forward. Any allegations of non-consensual sex are unequivocally denied by Mr. Weinstein, a spokesperson for the movie mogul has said. On Thursday, people reported that Weinstein checked into a luxury resort in Arizona after jetting out of Los Angeles on Wednesday. The source said the movie mogul was staying at the five-star hotel which boasts a spa and golf course because he doesn't want to go a place where he can't use his cell phone. His team set him up at a secure place to get him the help he needs, he knows and wants help, said another source close to the situation.